Sanctification seems like an old word, even an out-of-date word. Uh, it's rare that you would even hear a young pastor use the word sanctification. It, it basically comes from the idea of being separated, set apart. Uh, but it goes back to being set apart from sin. So that sanctification is the progressive disconnect in the life of a believer from sin toward righteousness. So when you become a believer, you have been justified, you have been declared righteous, and then the Spirit of God begins a process of not only declaring you righteous, but making you righteous. And uh, progressively, the Spirit of God works in the believer's life to continually separate that believer from sin. And of course, uh, to make this really operate in a church, it needs to be operating in the leadership. Uh, and the goal is to be like Christ. To, to, to conform to Christ. In 2 Corinthians 3.18, there's a wonderful statement where it says, as we gaze at the glory of the Lord and looking at his glory revealed in Scripture, we are changed into his image from one level of glory to the next. We go from glory to glory to glory toward Christ's likeness. This is the work of the Holy Spirit. That's sanctification. We're never perfect, but we're progressively we're becoming more like Christ one day in glory, we'll, we'll be like him.